Hello everyone, Sharif Abouzaid here with a new video and today I want to answer another common question which says that how long does it take to learn WordPress and the clear and direct answer to this question will be this it depends on what type of websites that you want to build using WordPress let's say that there are two common, common types of websites that you can use WordPress to build these these are like a basic website if you want to build a basic website or if you want to build a, an advanced WordPress website and let me tell you what I mean by a basic and an advanced WordPress website so now a very basic WordPress website will be like a business website or a brochure website that has like from five to ten pages that speaks about your business so this type of websites will include something like about a home page of course about us page or about me page a services page a contact forum page maybe a page about your testimonials maybe a page about pricing for your services and this is what I mean by a very basic website. If you just want to uh, build this type of websites, I think you need to uh, spend like 10 to 15 hours of your time to learn this using like watching some YouTube video tutorials. You can actually learn how to build these pages. You need to learn how to add like a header and a footer, how you can add your pages and how you can use a page builder, something like Elementor or Cadence Blocks to build the layout of your about us page, how you can add an image, how you can add a text, a header, and all of this can be learned from in like 10 to 15 hours. So I think this you can spend like two to uh, three to five days to learn these things. Now, if you want to build another or to add advanced features to your WordPress website, and, and here by advanced features, I mean, if you uh, turn off, you want to build a WordPress website that can be used to sell and build your online courses, if you want to have an online store inside your WordPress website, if you want to tear this basic website or business website into a marketing machine, so you need to add pop-ups, opt-in forms, connect this website to an email marketing platform. This is what I mean by advanced features for WordPress. This alone, this type of websites, you will need to add an additional 15, I think 15 to 20 hours maximum to learn how to do this, to set up your WordPress website to be used for an advanced feature. So basically, I believe that if you need only a basic website, you need to spend like 10 to 15 hours. If you want to have an advanced website, you need to add an additional 15 to 20 hours for the time to learn WordPress. And after this, I'm quite sure that you can have a functional website that you can start using to uh, build you, to promote your uh, uh, business whips, business, then you can add additional features along the way and this is actually the way that I learned uh, how to use WordPress I first starting by learning how to use WordPress to build my uh, business website it was back this it was like fifth, uh, five to eight pages website then I left it and then I added some additional features to uh, another business website which is how to turn this into a marketing machine how to add an optimum form so this I learned WordPress in stages and by the way yesterday I published another video about how uh, if you can learn WordPress on your own, I will leave a link down below for the other video if you haven't watched it and if you like to watch it. So uh, it depends on uh, how long does it take to uh, learn WordPress. It depends in the type of website you want to uh, build and actually, and actually, if you can, um, um, like, if you can set a time to learn WordPress, because if you just set like uh, 30 minutes a day, it can take you forever. Uh, to if it can take you like a month to learn WordPress, but if you just allocate and focus your time in two hours a day, you can actually learn this from like within a week to uh, how to actually use WordPress. So hopefully I have given you my clear cut answer to this question. If you find this video helpful, please give me a like and please consider to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I create WordPress videos that will help you learn WordPress very quickly. Now, thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Bye for now.